Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to explore on how to integrate Jira with Salesforce. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to create an account here for free. No credit card required, no software to install. But you need to provide your full legal name, work email, job title, and a lot more. And after that, all you're going to do is click on the agree button. Click on the start free trial and you're all set. Now the next step is to log into our Jira account. Now once you are here, integrating Jira with Salesforce can enhance collaboration between your project management and customer relationship management systems. Now for you to be able to do that, you have the options from here. Now on the left side of the panel, you can click on the find new apps. Or you can simply go to the upper corner on the top rightmost, click on apps and explore more apps. And it will be the same uh, thing. All you're going to do is click on search for apps here. That's going to be Salesforce. All right. And click on it. Now here. With the integration in place, you can view Salesforce data directly within Jira issues. And you have a lot of um, options here, but basically the first one is the one that we are looking for. Click on that. And it's a straightforward process. As you can see, you can seamlessly integrate Salesforce and Jira to enhance the visibility of information between teams and improve customer acquisition. All you're going to do is click on the try it free yellow button here and once you've done that there's another window that will pop up it's zero dollars per month after 30 day okay it's a very convenient now when you connect uh connect this to what will happen is you would be able to write data for the host application read data from the host application and just click on the start free trial button and you would notice a notification down in the left side corner adding connector for Salesforce and Jira, right? You just wait for it for a few seconds because uh, it is authenticating these apps. And then obviously you would receive a notification here that the installation was successful and you have an option to configure or manage app. When we click on the manage app, a new window will pop up for you to be able to enable private listings, enable development mode. And all I'm going to do is click on the apply button here and you're all set. Now, if you happen to have an account here in Zapier, that's going to be really convenient because you can create integrations between Jira Software Cloud and Salesforce to automate any workflow. And all you're going to do is to have that endless possibilities right here. Just click on the orange button here to connect these apps and after doing so the first thing we need to do is to create a zap matter of fact you can rename the uh, title here and obviously we need to set up a trigger and we need to choose jira as the trigger app when selecting a trigger event that will initiate the integration such as, such as new issue or updated issue and the action is going to be um, Salesforce because from here you can select the action you want to perform in Salesforce such as when the trigger event occurs like create lead or create case and then you can connect your Salesforce account and configure the action settings mapping Jira data to Salesforce fields as needed. And once you have done that, all you're going to do is click on the yes button to authenticate these app. You can sit back and relax because Zapier will do the work for you. But if you're more comfortable using your Salesforce account, why not go here in the help section we're in? This is a very step-by-step -step guideline on for the uh, Jira integration guide. I suggest you go here. And if you have any more problems or concerns with um, integrating your account, you might want to call or contact the uh, Salesforce customer service as from these numbers and click on the uh, let's chat button if you encounter any problems okay
and that's a wrap for today's video again by setting up the integration between jira and salesforce you can automate processes streamline communication between teams and ensure seamless collaboration between your product management and customer relationship management systems see you in the next video